Truly, it prepares for a slowdown in home searches and home price growth looks mixed in July. Ahead on Wednesday's News Wrap. With Labor Day ringing in the final weeks of summer, activity in most local housing markets is set to come down from its yearly peak. Based on trend data collected from 2011 through 2013, Truly it reported Tuesday that home searches on its website nationally come in 6% below the annual average for the months of September and October as summer transitions into fall. Among states in the largest U.S. metros, Trulia says the biggest post-summer drop-offs in home searches usually happen in the top warm-weather vacation spots, with parts of the south and southwest seeing double-digit declines. Not all markets are poised for a fall slump, however. While the beaches might empty in the coming months, home searches have shown post-summer growth in parts of New England and in areas of both coasts thanks to warmer, drier falls and proximity to popular winter vacation areas. Home price growth accelerated in July on a month-over-month -month basis, even as annual increases continue to slip, according to a market report. CoreLogic's home price index rose 1.2% from June to July, the company reported, lifting slightly from June's 1% monthly gain. The improvement includes both distressed and non-distressed sales. Compared to a year prior, July's index was up 7.4%, barely down from 7.5% in June. Looking a year out, CoreLogic predicts home prices, including distressed sales, will keep slowing to 5.7% by next July. You can check out these stories and all the latest happenings in the industry right here on our site. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again on Thursday here at TheMReport.com, your source for the latest news and strategies in the evolving mortgage market.